you look underneath the sink right now. This is a place we've had a lot of mice issues where they get up into the kitchen. And uh, we've already addressed a few areas. You can see where those water inlet valves are as well as that drain pipe is. We've done some work. Uh, you can see my other videos to make sure they're not getting up through there. But then we found that we're still getting moss droppings and they're coming from this back corner. And if I get my camera all the way back here, what you'll see is there's a big gap in the corner of the cabinetry or the sink where you can see light from underneath. Mice are definitely getting up through there because we had a bunch of moss droppings right here. So we're gonna need to seal that up. We're gonna show you how to do it real easily with some great stuff, Pest Block. All right, so there you can see our hole. Uh, it seems a little bit deep, so I want something that the great stuff pest block to grip on. So I'm going to take some steel wool, you see right here, and stuff it down there. Get it all the way down there, because I mostly just want this the pest block to grip on it. And that pest block, that make sure it's the great stuff pest block. The pest block version has a bitter taste to rodents. It's kind of a tough angle, so let me try to get back here. I've shaken it up for 60 seconds already, I'm going to suspense. Boom, that's probably all I need. All right, it's been about 20 minutes now. You can see the great stuff pest blocks expanded quite a bit. You can see it's pretty firm to the touch. So we can feel pretty confident this has been a great way to keep mice from coming up through this hole into underneath our kitchen sink. Mm -hmm.